YouTube, what's going on? Another good video coming out right now, I promise you. This is going to be a buffalo cauliflower uh, blend. I don't know if you can see that, let's get a little closer. And some Marie's uh, ranch on the side. Marie's, you get it Safeway. It's probably my favorite type of ranch. I don't know if you notice this. Well, you know what, I'm pretty hungry because I haven't eaten yet. I've been up for a while, it's about 3 p.m. right now. There was a lot of juice. There's a lot of juice in that one. I felt it in my throat. I swear I could take spicy food. <laughs> Anyways, do you recognize that with ranches, ranch, ranch dressing? When you go out and you have ranch dressing, usually it's delicious, right? You go out, Buffalo Wild Wings, ranch dressing, good. Wing stop, dressing's good. Even pizza spots, dressing's good. But when you buy it yourself, it just isn't the same. Why is that? Very juicy. I think that Mary's or Marie's, I found it at Safeway. You know, usually I get the whole craft or Hidden Valley. Mary's is pretty good. It works. It, it gives me a nice flavor of ranch, ranch that you usually find in a, a restaurant or so forth. And I think together, it, uh, puts the compounds together. Why do I say that? This is buffalo cauliflower, right? Now, don't get me wrong, beautiful keto dish about, I think it was, uh, five, it's about five net carbs per cup. Apparently there's three servings in here. I don't think it looks like three servings, but I'll go ahead and count 15 net carbs, that's fine. Uh, I'm gonna fast anyways after this, but. You know, a lot of that is coming from the cauliflower, definitely not the buffalo sauce. I don't think buffalo sauce has it. It's all right. This is one of those go-tos when you really don't have time to cook anything up. You really, um, you don't have the creative concepts to create something out of this. Yes, it's cauliflower and buffalo sauce. Great keto dish, you know. You can split this up into threes, mix it up with some other like low net carb dishes. Like what I could have done was used about a third of this, a little bit of cauliflower, and then some proteins on the side like chicken. Would have filled me up. Eat this with the chicken, then I get chicken. Um, it was a good way to get your veggies in, you know? Who likes cauliflower? I mean, I love cauliflower, but I feel like cauliflower isn't a, unless you, if you're not on keto, I feel like not a lot of people understand the, the quality of life cauliflower gives people, right? Before I was on keto, I'd never eaten cauliflower. I didn't know you can make pizza bread out of it. I didn't know you can make mozzarella sticks out of it. I didn't know you can eat it like this, buffalo chicken. It's a good veggie, and not a lot of people understand that. But when you're on keto, of course, we all know cauliflower is the go-to. Cauliflower is a man. Qualifier is a quality of life. It is good with the ranch though. I am pretty hungry. Maybe that's why it's kind of delicious. I don't know what's it's missing though. Maybe it's texture. So let me go through this with you. Let me actually break this down with, with you. So you know if you want this or not, okay? I don't know if you can hear that. Really juicy. Now the buffalo sauce is one thing, but I think the cauliflower, well cauliflower has a lot of liquid in it. Uh, when you do make keto dishes, you're supposed to, I like to get a little cheese rind, throw in all the cauliflower and just juice all that out. And that way it can make some really quality content. Like 
pizza bread, right? Or rice. I like to make rice out of cauliflower. Mashed potatoes. Let me tell you a great story about cauliflower and mashed potatoes. There's a restaurant, Lazy Dogs. They have, I think it's chicken breast, like a chicken, like a lemon chicken or something like that with cauliflower, mashed potatoes. Cauliflower mashed potatoes, that is a dream come true. Here's a restaurant, you know, a bunch of carbs everywhere, and you're out with your friends, you're out with your family, and you're like, cool, do they have any great keto dishes? You see this, cauliflower mashed potatoes, can you believe it? I couldn't. I order it, eat it, delicious, cauliflower mashed potatoes, fantastic. Learn to find out. Damn near half of it is potatoes. They put potatoes in it. So why even claim it to be cauliflower mashed potatoes if you're going to ruin it with potatoes in the first place? You can, you can see I was furious because I was trying to stay on keto. I mean, this fantastic meal. I'm going to come back, have this meal again. And there's potatoes in it. So there goes my entire meal. Now, what's the, what's the, the, the slogan? Have one cheat day. Come back and keep going. Like, don't even stop. Just go right back on keto, which is fine. I did that. Still mad. I'm butt hurt. I'm not just mad. I'm butt hurt. That was I was upset. I was upset. I got played. Fool me twice. Well, fool me once. So shame on them. Shame on them. Now this. This is a bird's eye brand. I don't know what bird's eye is. I found this in grocery outlet. Maybe they sell it at other places, but it is cauliflower buffalo wings. Uh, boneless, of course. Um, you know, it's good to stock up on because, like I said, you know, I didn't really want to cook much. I, I haven't eaten all day. I haven't eaten since last night. About 3 p.m. Getting a little fast in, I guess. And I just want something to whip up quick. Now, I've been doing these uh, one meal a day things. So since this is about 15 net carbs, that leaves me another, and this is the lowest end, another five net carbs for the rest of the night, which is totally doable. You know, have something super light, if I get hungry, because I'm trying to do the whole one meal, but if I get hungry, I have an abundance of net carbs to give away. Five net carbs, which, you know, if you think about it, I could eat 15 eggs right now, right here, right now. That's not good for you, <laughs> but I could do it. And throw some celery in there. No, the best way to do keto is to have a nice blend. Have a nice blend of vegetables and proteins, right? You, know, you don't want to go out there and eat a whole pack of bacon just because it's low carb. You want to throw in a couple other things in there, like some spinach. Spinach is great. All right, if you watched my last video, you already know this last bite's the best. But I'll tell you right now, I'm eating to survive on this one. I don't know if I'd do this again. In fact, I'll let you know right now. I advise against it. You're more than welcome to make a decision. You are a grown person. You can do what you want, but I did not like this very much. In fact, I don't know what to do. I bought five of them because I thought I was going to like it and I thought it'd be a nice little snack, but I have to figure out what to do with this. So let me think of some great ideas and maybe I'll come back with another video of what to do with broth, cauliflower, Buffalo chopped cauliflower. I mean, the buffalo is all right. Of course, the ranch really helped. Marie's ranch is. It's up there. Well, thank you so much for hanging out with me while I have lunch. I hope you enjoyed everything. 
subscribe, like, and leave a comment. We can talk and have a good time and talk about keto or something. Thank you.